stelle euch heute ein ganz besonderes... Today I show you a very special product and that is the Padai Racing Exhaust for the modern Best Buy GTS. The idea for this exhaust was already created on the 25th anniversary when we built the Padai Custom Scooter. The exhaust is now available in our warehouse and can also be delivered. Let's see right away how it looks and how it sounds when you drive it. Hi. Hello. I'd like the MV2202SR, please. Yes, we still have some of those. Should I quickly get the exhaust out of our storage? Yes, please. Can we come with you? Of course. Where do we have to go? Did you know that exhaust means knallpot in Indonesian? Yes, they have such funny names that sometimes sound half German. Did you know that the Portuguese actually are Suwaben? Zuiden? And do you know who the Suwaben are? They are the Swabians. Really? So Portugal and Swabia. Awesome, that's the one. Here is the gem. Here we have the connecting manifold, which is a complete system that goes from the exhaust to the connection to the muffler. That can also be a cut, right? That's right, a cut will go in there later. Then we come to the actual heart of the exhaust. This is the muffler and the exhaust. It looks a bit like from a motocross bike. Exactly like the manifold belly of the old two-stroke motocross bike. It has a heat shield, black end cap and two mounting holes to attach it to the engine. Also, here we have the spring connection or the spring hooks to connect it to the manifold. We don't show the assembly of the exhaust in this video because we shot an extra episode about it already. Sebastian, you shut the episode back then. How long does it take to install the exhaust? You should calculate about half an hour to remove the old exhaust and install the new one. And since it's a complete system, it's going to be a bit of a fiddly job. It's actually super fast. Yes, it's super fast. I can also show you that on my GTS outside. We can look at it together. Let's go! Looks like the Cascade. Indeed, it's incredible. But we're not here to promote Vespa accessories now. Where can you buy the item? At Zip? I'll tidy myself up a bit and then we'll ride. I thought that was the microphone. <laughs> Mr. Bao. <laughs> There's the scooter. Has it been used a little or have you ridden it a bit? Yes, we did a volume test with it. That's correct. We even measured the volume. We compared which is louder, the Malossi, Pordoi or the original. That's right. You built it all back and forth in one afternoon. Exactly. But it was fun. It was a good afternoon. The result is that the volume of the original exhaust is a bit below the Malossi. That means it's really within limits. With old Vespers it is easy to make a noise measurement because there are certain regulations. You go out onto a free stretch of road, drive at full speed for 50 meters and measure it with a calibrated device. Then you have a numerical value of the volume. With a modern Vespa from the 90s onwards this is much more difficult because you have to officially test the cycle in a lab by driving slowly, accelerate quickly, braking, etc. We have not yet been able to verify this in a short time available, which is why there are no official measured values and no ABE. But we are working on it and we have measured the new exhaust according to the old guidelines. For this we also used a device calibrated by a recognized technical service. So that there is a bit of truth to it when we claim that it really is quieter than a Malossi or even a bit louder than an original. Should we get a second Vespa for comparison? That's right, we still have an HPE Vespa with an original exhaust in the workshop which we could test against. This one? Yes, exactly. Then we can make a good comparison here how the original and the Podoi exhaust sounds. Do we need helmets? A few moments later. We now listen to the original first and then I ride off with my Podoi exhaust.
Ooh, cool, now I'm off with the Podoy exhaust system. When standing still, the original exhaust sounds like this. Now the Podoy exhaust. Is there actually a DB eater built in? Exactly, the DB eater is fixed with a screw, as in quite classic racing exhaust systems, which you can remove again easily. We also measured the noise of the original, the Malaysia and the Padoi exhaust system, based on the old regulations. We have also prepared and made the values available for you to download. So you have a good basis if you have someone from MOT, GTU or DECRA who might want to get involved in such a discussion. That would also be the conclusion of the video. I hope you enjoyed the video and the product as well. Feel free to press the bell button so we can keep you up to date. And I hope to see you next time again. Is that good? I'm waiting for something else to happen. No, it's done. Or should we do something else? Should I dance a little bit? He's waiting for a kiss. Stop it, put the camera away.